revitalization is a very important part of how we manage our fleet. As we introduce new ships, we uh, introduce new concepts, innovative designs, we introduce new experiences. So we want to bring it back to our existing ships. We have to bear in mind that ships are five years between dry docks. So we have a number this year here in Freeport, we have one in Singapore and we have two in Cadiz. It is all about communication. It is all about having the processes to follow. We're on Liberty of the Seas. Right after this, we head to Empress, and then Jewel, and then Majesty. We have Radiance that's coming up as well. We have Adventure that's coming up later in the year. We've ramped up for the last four years, and it's been building up to this, to this time. I guess I'm a 12th year at Royal. I don't think we've ever had a period like this. I have an incredible team that's behind me, design team, uh, structural engineers, naval architects, builders, who all collaborate to try to make that happen. The principal success elements are, are clearly finishing the project on time, on budget, with quality, but not just finishing the work, making sure the ship is handed over back to operations, absolutely fully ready in every respect. It's a very large coordination between different departments, different nationalities, different skill sets in a 28-day dry dock start to finish. When that first guest comes on, everything is finished, everything is clean. It takes quite a feat to do that.